If you're looking for a place to stay in the heart of our nation's capital, consider the Lord Elgin Hotel in Ottawa. Welcome back, I'm Kevin Kay from KevinK.com and today we're taking a look at the Lord Elgin Hotel in the heart of our nation's capital, Ottawa. On this channel, I do product reviews, do-it-yourself videos, and much, much more. So if you're new here, consider subscribing. And as we look in the front entrance of the Lord Elgin Hotel, the front desk is right there, and you can do your check-in, check-out. And then as well, they've got a very large lounge area. They've got a couple here, actually, so lots of seating if you wanted to just chill out and talk to some people or meet if you have to and things like that. There's a business center if you need to get in there and use a computer. I didn't go in, but I imagine they'll print for you and everything else. A row of pay phones you probably don't need and an ATM as we look at the variety store and an in-house Starbucks. Now downstairs, we're going to walk into the fitness center, and they've got quite a bit of uh, equipment in here for such a small uh, area, but there's enough stuff there, towels, and it overlooks the pool, which I'll give you a quick look at, but there's people swimming, so I'm not going to go too far with that, but it's a decent size. And there's the grill restaurant, which they'll give you a couple of coupons for when you arrive, and we'll head up to the room in a second. I'll direct you to their website so that you can make your booking, get the location right, and find out everything else Lord Elgin has to offer. And as we get to the room, I'll open the door here, and we'll take a look inside. It's just a standard room uh, with a couple of queen beds, and uh, right away when you walk in, there's your closet area. You can keep your clothes uh, and things like that, a decent-sized mirror for you to get ready without going into the bathroom again. And you can uh, put some stuff up here on the shelving, They've got uh, glasses for you and a few coffees on the house with that Keurig machine, which is nice enough to see. And then you have your uh, refrigerator with a freezer as well. And that's a good size. I like to keep a lot of drinks in my hotels. And then um, for your luggage, uh, they've got a little recycling box there as well. A little desk area or table that you can use with uh, what you'd expect, a phone, a notepad, your television with the remote, a seat for you to just relax if you want to, and then of course your hotel art so that you can feel at home. And as we look out the window, you're going to see, uh, it's not the most you know, fantastic view in the world, but uh, it's fine. And then I believe that that's Laurier Avenue West. And we look, and like I said, there's uh, the two queen beds. We've got these like mini reading lights. We didn't use those. A little table in the middle with a lamp and your alarm clock. And uh, it's a nice enough room. They give you a couple of menus for the restaurant downstairs, the grill, which we saw already. And it's uh, your pretty basic stuff. It's not uh, the highest price in the world, so it's okay if you wanted to just stay very close and have something there. And it's nice to see veggies and dip at the top of the kids menu there, so it's not just burgers and pizza all the time. But uh, as well, they've got a breakfast menu for you where you can get things from the grill uh, and then you can select what time of the morning you want to have that. And then as well, because we have an in-house Starbucks there, you are able to order from Starbucks and they'll bring that to your room at a specific time if you want. So that's all right. And as we look into the bathroom, there's a very big mirror with a nice um, light around it for you there. Your counter, they give you soap and shampoo and all the things you'd normally expect. Uh, they do the thing with the towels where you can use your towels more than once if you want to. And as you see under the counter, they give you a little bit extra of the things you probably need. So that's it. That's a look at the Lord Elgin Hotel in Ottawa. So hopefully you got some value from this video. If you did, I hope you'll give it a like, comment on the video, share it with your friends, and I hope you'll subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you next time, KevinK.com. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.